provide with the upgrade required for your database like the certificate is uh, CA RDS CA certificate authority 2019 will uh, reach end uh, or going to expire this year August 2022 uh, 20, 22 August uh, 2024 and uh, this need to uh, be upgraded before the uh, uh, schedule date so uh, I need to check like uh, which uh, which of the database is uh, having uh, like uh, which database need to be upgraded with this certificate and all so let's see how to upgrade this certificate first I will check this database I think this database is not having the proper certificate uh, so what I will do I will go under the maintenance and I will check new operating system update is available okay and uh, if I come to the detail I will get like with certificate so you can see here RDS CA 2019 is in use and uh, DB instance certificate expiration date is 2024 so before that I need to update the certificate and all so what I will do I will go in the configuration and uh, I will do the modification what are things need to modify here one is certificate and one is to DB uh, database engine upgrade so for now DB engine is uh, here you can see till 16 it comes but what I will do I am not going to upgrade that to a major version I am leaving the database version first just I am going to upgrade the uh, CA certificate if you see this uh, it's going to expire this much time and uh, this 260 RDS CA 2048 so I will be upgrading to this one this CA either you can use any one of one of this so I will use this default one and uh, it's asking for client uh, you confirm because I know my application will not get affected but if you don't have idea about this uh, make sure your uh, application side support this type this certificate upgrade and uh, enable delete protection yeah it's fine and uh, do I am doing any changes no more changes not required so I will continue here in the next section uh, I will see like what are the attributes are going to change here so apply immediately modify the DB instance and here we go here this uh, DB will be modified shortly next I have to downgrade this DB because it's uh, the if I go to the monitoring and uh, if I see the cloud was detail the DB is uh, under unutilized and uh, I need to downgrade it uh, to lower version so for that what I will do I will again go in the configuration uh, okay so I will go in the configuration and uh, here I will change the same thing same options but the DB engine version version I will not going I'm not going to change I have to downgrade only this uh, from 2xl to Excel and that's it advanced setting is provisioned IOP okay I am using GPT-3 that's why it's uh, I don't use this okay and uh, see here this one I am using so let's see what are the changes required here it's only the DB instance modify so I will simply modify the DB and here it's gone like this DB is being modified as I shown and again this will be modified based on my current uh, configuration 
and this is how you modify the db when you um there is two type of modification one is, one is immediate effect and one is uh, like uh, scheduled in the next maintenance cycle if you want to upgrade so i have applied the immediate effect here it's modified and uh, it's updated with the if i go inside this db and i see like the cs certificate still it's saying no uh, the cs certificate expiration is march 2025 so this is updated and certificate authority is 61 so it, this certificate is not going to expire now and uh, here it's like uh, the certificate is updated for this db Thanks for watching, please subscribe and press the bell icon for the latest updates.